Good, Good morning, morning Eagles. Eagles. Welcome to the Eagles Nest News Morning Show. I am Miss Jenkins, the very, very proud principal of South Columbus Elementary School. And I am Miss Griffin, the very, very blessed assistant principal of South Columbus Elementary School. And today is Wednesday, September 22nd, 2021. Welcome to the morning show. Hello, hello. And what a beautiful day it is to me. You know, oh. I love it. It's really not as cold as I thought it was going to be. It's not cold at all. Well, I had expected it to be cold. Okay. You know, for me, it's okay. cold. It, because 55 is cold, but it's not 55. And yeah, that's going to be the low probably tonight. The, and the high today is going to get up to 82 yes, degrees. Yes. Yeah, right now it's definitely not 55, but no. you know, I had expected it to be way cooler when I got it's here this morning. It's about 72 right now. Just And that's beautiful. Yeah, that's 72. why it's so beautiful. Mm -hmm. And um, tomorrow it's going to be mostly cloudy again today, but tomorrow we're going to get some more sunshine. Woo. And it's going to warm up a bit. Hopefully. I like it. And a low of 53. Mm -hmm. Yay, that's great. Mm -hmm. Well, for lunch today, y'all. <laughs> Uh, we are going to have a meatless Wednesday, oh, but you're still, still going to get your protein in, is what Miss Bigelow says. So for our meatless Wednesday menu, we are having cheesy, cheesy, cheesy breadsticks with marinara sauce, green beans, fruit milk. As always, teachers get your lunch counts in by 9 a.m. so that they can prepare adequately. And if you are a parent or student watching, Remember to support our school nutrition program by buying the extras, such as ice cream, chips, and juice. Thank you from Miss Bigelow. All right. And today's theme is... It's Winning Wednesday. Wednesday. And yeah. it's the joke of the day, sent in by Skylar in Miss Bush's class. Miss Bush's class is going to get the Top Fans Award for this yes, week because they yes. are always tuned in. What is the joke of the day? So what... Did the frogs say to each other? <laughs> well, I don't like frogs, but that's a kind of cute frog, but it's still kind of gross because it's ugh. Okay. Anyhow, uh, what did the frogs say to each other? What did the frogs say to each other? Hmm. You know, I don't know frog language, so I don't know. Tell me, what did the frogs say to each other? Let's stick together. <laughs> <laughs> Why do they stick? Yeah, that's sticky. Those tree frogs are sticky oh, they and gross. Are. Yes, yes. Okay, let's mm. stick together because they're sticky tree frogs. Yeah. Uh, maybe we should have had a fact about tree frogs. No, it's okay. Um, before we could get yeah. the joke, but so, that's cool. That's it's cool. A, mm. Okay, never mind. All right. Mm -mm. Other announcements. It is <laughs> Hispanic Heritage Month, and so we have our fabulous um, Hispanic um, Month historians, yes. back tellers. Um, joining us again today, so take it away, girls. Good morning, I'm Akela Fuela from fifth grade. Good morning, I'm Kay Miles, fifth grade. Tell me, honoring Henry Cisnero. This gentleman was the U.S. Secretary of Housing and Urban Development from 1993 to 1997 under President Clinton. Este caballero estaba en U.S.A. Secretary of Urban Development de 1993 he was born June 11, 1947 in San Antonio, Texas. San Antonio, Texas. Sister Narrows was elected to the city council in 1975, mm -hmm. becoming the youngest councilman in San Antonio's history. Sentado estaba primero de la ciudad en el Clonan en 1965 se hizo el más chiquito Clonan de San Tiano Historial. Wow. 
Antonia, Texas. I went there once and I loved it. Like I was ready to move. I called my husband and said, I want to move here. <laughs> it's beautiful. I love it. I think the weather, although it's hotter, is a little less humid. Mm -hmm. And so I think it's good for people who have like allergies and stuff. Yeah. I've been to Dallas, Fort Worth, I've not been to San Antonio. Yeah. But they have a lot of history there. That's why like, I loved it. I mean, mm -hmm. it's just the beautiful Alamo with the and culture all of that stuff. and the history. I and they love have it. those cacti and whatnot. And, and I was stuff. blown away by the Alamo because in my mind, I thought it was way bigger. It's not big? The, no. Oh. Okay. Yeah, Other sure. announcements, <laughs> um, just reminder about basketball practice and chair practice today after school. And we're having our first art club meeting tomorrow, Miss Countryman. Something that I can do that they don't require a birth certificate for. <laughs> <laughs> um, but you, do you have a parent permission form? You're not going to be allowed in if you did not return your parent permission form. I will have one before tomorrow. Okay, so mm -hmm. from 2.30 um, to 3.20, you're going to meet Miss Countryman in the art room at 220 when you're released by your teacher also girls inc is going to be closed tomorrow mm. but they will reopen on friday so parents send an email a note call the school um, let your teachers know um, let your students teachers know how they're going to be getting home tomorrow since girls inc is going to be closed Oh, and the last thing is today after school, if you are on leadership team, we have a meeting in the media center. Make sure that you um, come out to the meeting, which will last less than an hour. And I think um, that's it for today's edition mm -hmm. of the Eagles Nest News. Y'all please remember to be safe and remember the three W's. Wear your mask, wash your hands, and watch your distance. And as always, we soar at South Columbus where I, I am, am safe, safe, I am organized, organized I am accountable, and I am respectful. respectful. See y'all tomorrow for Thankful Thursday. Y'all have a great day. Bye-bye.